We have been playing for 23 and a half minutes into the last quarter. Norm Smith, the man without the hat, is the coach, a worried coach of the Melbourne side. They trail by two points as McLean gets set to kick the ball out for Collingwood. There's the drop kick by McLean to the halfback line and Dixon flies to take the mark. Dixon, a stalwart of the Melbourne team for many years, has played well today. On the half-forward line, he sends it forward. Up they go. Barassi in there. Can't pull the mark down. Taken by Neil Compton. Compton kicks in towards goal for Melbourne. A goal to equal Gemelich's performance, and the stadium's gone crazy. Neil Compton, a back pocket player, will be the hero of all Melbourne tonight. If Melbourne take this premiership out. A goal from a back pocket player is unheard of. Melbourne, four points in front, have everything in their favour. The ball is on their scoring zone at the moment. Picked up by Reeves. Cutting would come in to attack the ball on the half-forward line. Henderson gives it to Dalton. Collingwood forcing it forward. Dalton has the ball. Kicks it in. Picked up by Ian Graham. He's tackled. Graham is met by three Melbourne players. It's in front of the Collingwood goal. What a finish. What a game. It's all over. It's all over. Melbourne premiers for 1964. John Henderson, the Collingwood player, exhausted. Norm Smith, Melbourne coach. Players from both teams congratulating each other. And what a terrific finish to the 64 Grand Final. Terrific, fantastic. How else could you describe it? I'm sure today that we have seen one of the greatest spectacles of our Australian games ever played on this ground. I would like to congratulate the Collingwood side on their wonderful performance and, and give them my good wishes and to you Ron as captain of the winning side all good wishes, congratulations for a wonderful game from all of us.